So today I am talking about music again, specifically rock music because rock music gets a lot of hate from people saying how it's all about anger and aggression and it's just shouting and swearing and that's all that you get from rock music and that it gets a lot, a lot of stick does that as does rap for having that sort of feel to it and today I want to talk about my top five songs that have a hell of a lot of deeper darker meaning to it so let's kick things off right now number five Linkin Park's Leave Out All The Rest now Linkin Park's Leave Out All The Rest is a song about a guy who's made his mistakes in his life and there's a lot of stuff that he's had unaccomplished that he's not quite finished in his life but he still just wants people to forget about that and he wants people to remember the good and the good stuff that he's done within his life. Uh, so it's a very, very powerful song about all that that someone wants to just be remembered for the stuff that he's done and stuff that he's tried to do rather than stuff that hasn't quite been accomplished and stuff that there's mistakes that were made. I think that's a fantastic, fantastic reason to write a song. And the song itself, with its a soft sound as well is just absolutely fantastic now another song that has a very similar sort of feel to it is Alter Bridge Watch Over You now the reason why that's at number four is because it's a song that's about a guy that um, wants his other half to kind of have someone to look after her when he's gone and he wants is he's kind of like a soft emotional one but in the same way that you realize that he's already gone in the same sort of way uh, it, it's a very tough one to describe as a song really uh, but depending on how you listen to the song depends on what sort of feel you get across for it is it a guy that say gone off to war and ended up being killed and is they wanted to say well who's going to look after her when I'm gone is it someone who's saying well what if I was to go off to war and die and who would then look after her and I suppose it's a, a guy that's looking for answers looking for someone who who's going to step up and be that person to look after uh, it's kind of it's a really soft emotional one about someone who wants someone to be there for the other half but who's it going to be if you're not around anymore I mean it, it's a it makes you question a lot of things as well about life in general which is why it's made it to number four it's a really really powerful song uh, another one that I like for a completely different reason is Enter Shikari's System Meltdown now yes I know System and Meltdown are technically two different songs but the it's it's a two part song that's all part of one song really so I'm calling it as it is System Meltdown now this song in general touches on some different sort of stuff it's a very politically based song I mean with Enter Shikari I could have picked any one of a thousand songs which were quite politically based and how they're taking a stand against uh, the politicians and just general politics and the world that is wrong today and the reason why I've gone with System Meltdown is because it is so beautifully wrote that some of the things that you uh, don't even realise at the start uh, you think it's just a standard sort of song and you don't even quite realise at the start what some of it's even about and then when it kicks in you realise that it's about how our system is broken and we need to take a stand and we need to fix what's wrong with the world, fix what's wrong with our system because the way that politics are today is just broken and bent and wrong and in some of the stuff that he says today, I mean if you just listen to it you, you'll see that so many things need to change in the world of politics and in the world today and it's, it, all of their songs kind of touch 
on that feel, but this one, this one really, really drives it home, really hits it hard. Now, number two is a song by Slipknot. Now, again, I could have picked any one of a thousand songs of theirs, but I went with The Devil and I. Now, they all, all of their songs really touch on that deep, dark, angry side. That they've got all their demons inside and they're conquering their demons, conquering all their problems that they've got in life. But Devil and I was a song after uh, one of their guitarists, Paul Gray, died. Now, after Paul Gray died, they then wrote the chap uh, the uh, the Gray chapter album, and with that album came a lot of songs about Paul Gray's demons. I mean, he had a lot of issues with drugs, a lot of problems like that, and in the end, that's what killed him. And Devil in I is one of those things where the song talks about all the issues that you've got in life and how. If you just take a stand and fight your demons, then you're always going to come out the other side a hell of a lot stronger. And that's what it's about, how if you let the demons take control of you, and let the demons take over all your issues and problems, then it's going to wear you down and eventually it's going to kill you. But if you stand up, take a stand, fight against all your problems, uh, that's what the song is about. And it's about kicking your demons essentially and there is a lot of issues in the world today a lot of problems, a lot of say like drug related problems, there's thousands of different problems but it's a song about whatever your demons are, whatever your problems are you can overcome them and I love the song, that, I love that song just for that reason alone but they have a lot of issues where they're, they're wanting to get their problems out and their anger out so Number two doesn't just go to Devil and I, it goes to a lot of their songs, to be fair, for that reason. But before I get to number one, I need to throw in some honourable mentions. Now, uh, I'm going to very quickly skim over this because there was a thousand songs that I could have picked. Uh, and I might do another list later on with more songs that are just like this. Uh, but first of all, I'm going to have to say Avenger Sevenfold's Dear God. Uh, that's again got the same sort of feel to watch over you. Of uh, he's wanting to know what will happen with his missus. He wants God to look over his other half whilst he's not around, whilst he's off at war fighting a war, just whilst he's a thousand miles away. He just wants God to take care of him in that moment whilst he's away. And I think it's an absolute beautiful song for that. Uh, Papa Roach, Gravity, that's another song where uh, it's got so much going on where it just looking to overcome so that's another one I'm skipping through these quick as possible actually uh, Stain Tangled Up In You there's so much meaning in that song uh, Skin Dread Say It Now a song about one of his friends that he lost and wished that he told him that he loved him before but never had a chance that song really really hit home with me uh, so I absolutely adore that song for all the meanings that it's not just got for other people but for some of the personal feel it has as well. And uh, Hollywood Undead's Bullet as well. Uh, it comes across as a happy, cheerful song, but when you really listen to the lyrics, it's about people that are looking to commit suicide, and no matter what they do, they can't overcome it, they always keep trying. Uh, and then it, at the end with that little girl, it, it hits home that it doesn't matter how old you are, there's still people out there that have issues and can't cope with it. But, number one, my number one pick. Now, I could have picked so many of their songs too, because they've got so many songs about war and the problems with war and all these other things, but I've got to go with Five Finger Death Punches, Remember Everything. Now, the reason I've got to go with Remember Everything is because this is a song uh, about him as a child that was in a bad place with his family and his parents and no matter what he tried to do no matter what they did to say they were sorry and try to get past everything he couldn't really get past it because he remembers everything he remembers everything that they did everything they did to him did for, 
and uh, you know it, it's really really hit home and to the, the fact that there's some people with that song as well that like obviously I, I've just said there that it hits home and I feel bad about that because when I say it hits home I don't mean that I had issues myself and didn't I've had an amazing family life and I love my family for that but when I say it hits home I mean the reason why I said that is because there were so many people after that song uh, came out that went well I'm in a my family abused me as a kid I got beat by my father I, and so many people came out after that song and said that there was having issues as a child that has affected them when they've grown up and it helped a lot of people did that song because I suppose people weren't really coming out and saying well yeah my father beat me this is what happened at home this is what issues I had and people didn't really come out and say much and then when this song came out people kind of said so it is okay to say something then okay and a lot of people came out stood the ground said the feelings and I wouldn't say that all of that's down to Five Finger Death Punch, but that song did a lot for a lot of people. And that's why I put it at number one, because not only have Slipknot said about all their demons and they wanting people to overcome their demons, this is a different side of it, of whether it's been domestic abuse, child abuse, anything like that, this is the one where, even if you've just had a bad life as a child, this is that song that's making people want to come out, say something, and to stop it from happening in the future as well. So, when people talk about rock being a bad influence on people, you're wrong. So, this has been my thoughts on top songs that have got so much meaning and power to it. Do you agree with me? Let me know in the comments of other songs that you think might should have been in the list. And I may do another one in the future of other songs just the same reason. That's been it for me today though guys, so I'll see you.